We'll have a, a meeting uh, and the senior and junior members of the team will have a discussion about what is it that the client is really asking us and what is it that we need to do to answer that question, to that kick-off meeting. And then especially the junior members of the team will, will go away and gather some evidence. All the best strategy advice is based on a really good understanding of today, of trends, uh, of how the world's evolving and what competitors are doing. And the junior team members will spend a lot of their time on the project, especially in the first two thirds, gathering that evidence, processing it, working out what's going on. And then towards the end of the project, we'll come together and think about um, a creative recommendation for the client. So again, we'll all get back together in a meeting um, and uh, discuss the different options, discuss all the evidence that we've gathered and see where it adds up for the client. Uh, because it is the best training in business you can get anywhere. Much better than an MBA, uh, certainly better than going to work for a corporate. The amount you learn and the pace you learn uh, in the first two or three years of a consulting career is second to none. And that's a combination of some formal training, so probably six weeks or so of formal training over the first couple of years of your career, but also the experience-based training that you get on the job from solving this variety of problems. And if you want to develop your career as fast as possible, really whatever you want to do in business, be it an entrepreneur or to become a chief executive of a large business, there's no better start than a few years in consulting. The experience requirement is nil. Uh, you don't need to have worked in a business before, you don't need to have done an internship, um, you don't even need to have read the Financial Times or The Economist ever in your life uh, to get a job in consulting. really analytical way of thinking, a really logical way of thinking, a really clear way of thinking, uh, but also a way of thinking that's quite pragmatic. Uh, we haven't got three years to solve this problem, we have three weeks, so you have to be able to make a judgement about when you know enough uh, that a decision is right and to stop analysing it. So the, the way the case study, as it's called, at the heart of the consulting interview works is it's designed to be a real project and you start asking the real question that the client asked, you give some evidence and you help the candidate uh, in the interview, the interviewee, uh, go through the problem solving process and you see how well they do that and whether they come with a good recommendation at the end. The two slightly helpful answers are a little bit of practice helps. Um, if only because it will put you at ease. And there are lots of resources out there to help you with the case study interview. The second helpful answer is to enjoy yourself. Uh, if you're enjoying yourself, then we'll know that you're the kind of person who enjoys that problem solving process, uh, and also the kind of person that we want to work with, but also it'll, it'll bring out the best in you.